girls don't fart, okay? Okay? Okay. Okay. <sighs> Happy fourth birthday, Ella. Do you know who that's from? That's from Auntie Nicole and Giorgio and Angela and Tavin and Raquel. Oh my goodness. These pages are stupid. Girls don't fart, okay? <gasps> Ethan ate a lot of beans, which made his bottom rumble. Burp! Oh, Ethan, stop that smell and noise, his family used to grumble. But Ethan felt it wasn't fair. He couldn't help his tummy. He's surely not the only one whose toots upset his mummy. So Ethan asked his group of friends, Does everyone get wind? Marty laughed. <laughs> Fizz looked confused. And Sam just quietly grinned. Oh, yeah. But little Trixie took offense. Girls don't fart, okay? Only boys make bottom noises. We girls aren't built that way. The boys just didn't believe her, so they set themselves to test to see if girls passed wind or not. That would be their quest. <gasps> the school was serving eggs that day, which made the boys all think, now's our chance to check things out because this should raise a stink. They waited in the playground where the girls all skipped and jumped and listened very carefully. They heard a little flump. Oh, <gasps> flump! Aha! 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 They cheered. That one's confirmed. Let's try to find some more. Ethan waved his wand and they all vanished out the door. They flew to the place where they landed with a bump. No way, they laughed. We'll never prove that royal females trump. Poof! Princess Pearl played in her room, so to their door they went, thinking she was all alone. She let off a strawberry scent. The boys crept through the bushes and past the fancy fountain, where they gasped to see a unicorn in the shadow of a mountain. Ethan led them closer, and as the boys drew near, all the colors of the rainbow erupted from her rear. Pop, 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 pop. Their next stop was the ocean, and they dived beneath the waves. Then Marty spied a pretty mermaid swimming in the caves. The friends could hear the murking, who was telling off his daughter. He said it wasn't ladylike to make bubbles in the water. Poof, poof. Ethan cast another spell and whisked them to a glad, where Mrs. Squirrel gathered nuts while her children played. So the boys watched oh so silently, oh so silently until they heard a flutter. <gasps> Mrs. Squirrel did a fart that smelled of peanut butter. Toot, toot, toot. What a whiff, the boys declared. Just wait till we tell Trixie. Then floating past their hiding space flew a cheeky little pixie. The boys crept along behind the pixie. <gasps> Following their noses, then spreading out behind her came a pink cloud that smelled of roses. Shh. Do your tooties smell like a roses, Amelia? <laughs> I don't know. Next, Ethan cast a spell that whisked them back to Marty's house. They gathered in his bedroom where they spied a lady mouse. She ran behind the wardrobe and Fitz knelt to take a peek. He he he, he laughed. The mouse just did a tiny bottom squeak. Squeak! Oh, she was hiding for privacy for her toot. They heard a meow, and in a flash, the mouse was on the run. The kitten started chasing her, trying to have some fun. The kitten looked adorable with soft, white, fluffy fur. She was so relaxed that she let out a stinky purr. Poof! The boys had seen enough to prove to Trixie that she was wrong. They were hurrying to find her when they heard a ballet song. A ballerina did a fart. This was the best one yet. Her smelly bottom made the dancer spin and pirouette. Do you toot to pirouette at dance, Amelia? Yeah. You do? What about you, Ella? No. No? You do? That's good. Now they must find Trixie to tell her what they'd seen. They had enough proof to show that girls aren't always squeaky clean. Mermaids, dancers, lady mice, princesses as well, making rainbows, bubbles, clouds of pink with various sorts of smell. Trixie and her friends were picking flowers in the park. The sun was sh sinking in the sky, and it was getting dark. Suddenly they heard a noise, a gentle whisper sound. Trixie flew up in the air with glitter all around. Poof. Trixie gasped and hit her face. The fairies all went quiet. Caught in the act, the boys 
all cried. Now you can't deny it. The 